we're doing a maintenance on the vehicle today. We're gonna change oil filter. We're probably gonna do the differential transmission. As you can see here, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna change the oils, uh, fluids of the car. We're gonna do that by lifting the car. And I'm not gonna do a tutorial because there's a lot of videos on YouTube to show you how to do that. We're just doing this to keep record and keep a history on the car. Uh, we're just doing this, not as a tutorial, but just like record and see what we're doing, the progress of the build. There's a lot of things we're gonna do. This was supposed to be video number two, but we had a little setback and what we're gonna do is we're gonna do that video later on. But with that being said, we're gonna start lifting the car and changing the fluids. GoPro stop recording. And uh, as you can see, we installed a new rack and pinion for the car. That's the video we're working on right now, how the, the process we did to change this. But, but today what we're gonna do is change oil and filter because we got the car and we don't know how old the oil is, so we're gonna change all the fluids. We have a 13 socket. About to remove this. It's pretty loose. Probably hang tight. It's gonna be a, like a mess. It's, it's not thing. under it. Huh? It's not under it. It's not? No, it's right. Yeah, but it's gonna go, it's gonna shoot out this way. Did you move the phone? Yeah. It's gonna spray all over me. So probably gonna need a rag. Alright, let me get a rag first. Hold on. Take this off right here. I haven't done this in since my last car, a Toyota 86. That was the last time I did a oil change. So, still got it on me. First thing I learned how to do uh, maintenance on the vehicle. Alright, ready? Mm -hmm. oh, I dropped it. I picked it up. So, we're gonna let it drain. And we're about to uh, go up the engine bay and let loose of the filter. We're we'll changing that. We're gonna change now the spark plugs. And we just got these from uh, AutoZone. And I'm gonna show my son here how to install them. The four, so I'm gonna make sure. Here, we got the right socket for it. Yep, we're good. All right, let's get this changed. Okay, while we let this engine drain the oil, we're gonna change uh, spark plugs. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get all these four removed. Pull these out. Do is one by one so I don't miss the, the sequence of the cables. Take this out. And we're going to see how the condition of these uh, spark plugs are going to be. As you can see they're uh, they're not that bad but yeah I'm gonna remove everything get them replaced so that's number one I got them all measured here put this one in make sure I don't hit anything there we go like I said I haven't done these in years I always take my vehicles to maintenance because I don't have the time. But now that we have this project car, I'm gonna start working with my son and uh, teach him a little bit I know. And record, record it so we have footage of what we've done to the car so far. Connect. 
spark plug one done. So I'm not gonna bore you doing the rest of them. It's just simple. We're gonna take the cable off, replace them, and that should be it. Uh, so this is my son right here. He's doing his first uh, maintenance on his car. First spark plug, right? Very easy, easy procedure to do. Easy maintenance you can do anywhere. There we go. Nice. All right, so we're down to the last one. Last uh, spark plug. There we go. I will. I will take it off the ratchet and just go by hand. And then uh, to tie it up, put the ratchet on. No, no. Take the ratchet off and go by hand. The ratchet to uh, give it the final type. There you go. We already uh, drained uh, the engine, uh, we changed the spark plugs. What I'm going to do now is uh, put back the plug and I'm going to remove the filter. But I don't want to put all that oil, when I, I know the filter when I take it out is going gonna, is gonna to spill a lot of oil. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a, put a container back there so it doesn't catch any oil. And then uh, I'm just going to put now the plug. That is done. Yeah, I took the uh, filter off and what I like to do, I don't know if you heard, there's a k and filter. What I like to do is, uh, I know you've seen that everybody gets oil and they lubricate the ring right here so for, for the seal. But what I like to do is put uh, oil in there so when you turn the engine on, it's just not sucking air, it's sucking uh, oil from there. So I'm just gonna fill it up, loop the ring, and install it. Look at that. See how dirty it is. That's metal shavings right there, you can see them. Clean up. Okay, we took the plug from the transmission, and just to show you, there's a magnet attached to this, right? So, watch how it attracts the the top. Watch, watch this. Look at this. This is how much metal shaving we got from that magnet magnet plug. Look at this. See that? Okay. okay, we just did the transmission fluid and there's probably like there's probably like four ounces of oil. And we already replaced that. We already put what three bottles we put? Two and a half. We put two and a, two and a half bottles for four ounces that we took out. So that transmission is pretty empty, pretty dry. So I'm excited to see how this one's gonna come out. 
probably gonna look like chocolate. Let's see. I don't know how it goes. Yep. So you can cut it. Doesn't look that bad. Yeah, I see the plug. Yeah, needed to be changed. GoPro stop recording. Okay, this is the plug for the differential. And I'm gonna show you how much metal shade is on this thing. Watch. Look at this. Very attractive. Look at that. So, here we go. I'm glad we changed it. Okay, we're done. We changed the fluids of uh, transmission. We did also the differential and we changed oil and filter and we took the car for a test drive and uh, it drives it drives better we're done for today we did all the fluids we wanted to change uh, let me get the shadow out we're gonna do more videos of uh, installation parts stay tuned we're gonna show you more stuff we're gonna get more updates on the 240 if you haven't subscribed go ahead and subscribe and also, if you have, thank you very much. We'll appreciate it. And we'll see you on the next one.